it's me, YD28, and welcome back to my channel with The Sims 4 Disney Princess Legacy Challenge. Welcome back. <laughs> and Snow White is swimming, and she looks mighty um, uncomfortable. Or mighty sad, I don't know. She just looks funny to me right now. But I'm very, very excited because Ella is a teenager, and when she gets back from school in a little tiny bit... We are going to go uh, make some friends when she's back from school. We're going to go visit the, the new home where all her friends are. Made by you. <laughs> I know. I know. It's so exciting, right, Snow White? Jump for joy. Jump for joy. Anyway, Snow White looking mighty fine. What I want her to do is... Oh, she already jogged today. Um, also, I got a notification. Barrett is near his life end. So he might die this part. <laughs> Snow is just pre-crying because she's going to be a horrible mess when that happens. She should call someone on the phone. Who are we friends with? We're friends with that Mitchell guy, aren't we? Where is he? Oh, no, we aren't. He's dead. Well, why don't we call uh, your daughter? That'll help you out, yeah? That'll help you out. She's like, I'm just so lonely. Blog about your feelings. That's an excellent idea. Where is that? Blog about your feelings. Come do that. That sounds like fun. These bowls are also disgusting. Ella needs to clean up hard when she gets home. Clean up hard. Which, uh, they should be home now. What's going on? What's going on? Where's my fa There they are. It takes them half an hour to get home. I don't know. But it's also Edward's birthday today. So he'll be aging up. We're going to have to make a cake for him. But here come all the kids just jogging in. They're really cute. Oh, look who's here. Nicholas. Say hi, Nicholas. Hi. So we're going to uh, get Ella's uh, fun up quickly. And then she's going to go out and visit. So I'm going to get just have all the team. Oh, wow. That's rude. <laughs> watch. Have all the teams watch comedy together. And the twins can actually come out here and play pirate. That'll be funsies for them. And Ava's now sad. She's just like, I'm so upset. Being beautiful is so upsetting. And Barrett's actually home and he brought home 984 simoleons. And he's just uncomfortable. He's hungry and kind of tired. So he's going to eat some garden salad and sleep. Bye-bye. Actually, not sleep, but take a nap. While Snow is blogging about her feelings. But anyways, so let's speed up time just a smidgen. Good. That is good enough, girl. You need to clean up all these dishes, please and thank you. And maybe go on a quick cleaning frenzy? I don't know. And maybe just serve some garden salad quickly. And then we're going to go out. Don't you worry. Then we're going to leave. Are you going to... Oh no, my fridge is broken. That's just fantastic. Well, okay, you just won't eat this part, because whatever, I don't care. What we're going to do is we're going to pop into M. And the household is right here. So, uh, we're traveling with nobody. We're going to go there ourselves. And what I was also thinking was having Edward and A... Because, well, I'll explain in a second. All right, friends. So, everyone's outside. I think because I was doing stuff in... Uh, manage world so that you know that makes you pop out outside but this is all the household here is our crazy elder person who does not matter but uh, it is a household of three girls and three boys so the boys are our prince charming contenders and the girls are gonna be like our posse I'm very excited this beauty is Jasmine Araja Jessica Mooney and then we have uh, Charming West over here is Brandy King, Lucas Charming, so like Charming and Charming, whatever, <laughs> and uh, what is his name? Uh, Dylan Anderson. So I love all of these Sims. I want to thank you guys so, so much for making them. I adore them all and am really excited. I don't know who to marry. They're all really, really sexy, although I kind of feel like him, but he's kind of, I don't know, maybe he's... Maybe she, maybe she likes Anderson. Or Dylan Anderson. I'm gonna call you Anderson. 
Or maybe she likes charming. He is like, she reminds me of his dad a lot. So I don't know. Anyways, we're going to hit play. What we're going to do is we're going to introduce ourselves to everybody. <laughs> just like this. And, oh, this is their house. It's quite nice. Quite nice. It's quite large. If we look like this, we go down the stairs. Boop, boop. Oh, I can't go down the stairs because I have to knock on the door. But anyways, we're just saying hi. Getting to know them all. Brandy. Dylan Charming. Lucas. Introduce yourself to Jasmine. Do it. And then knock on the door. We need to get to know everyone. Every single one of you. So we're just talking it up. Getting to know each other. This old man is so creepy. <laughs> his name is... What is his name? Leonard Ham. Because I thought that was cool. But anyways... Oh, Brandy has a tattoo. Brandy, you badass. Stop it, you. Stop it, you. I want to knock on the door. Let me knock on the door. I want to go inside. Come on in. Cool. Okay, cool. So now we can see the house. Boom. It's like this. It's quite nice. I did not decorate this, by the way. It's just what the gurus did. Just super nice. Come up here and introduce yourself to uh, Jessica Mooney. Say hi, hi, hi. Cool. Now we know them all. So what we can do is we can head back home. We can head home now and throw our birthday party for Edward and invite them all over, actually. Charming. And let's bring Nicole and Jason and Nicholas. Oh. Never mind. We can only bring... Well, we're going to bring them all over to our place instead. Because our place is a little more exciting than theirs, just saying. We have a pool. We have a bar. We got a TV. Um, we have a logic table. Plus, Ava and Edward can get to know the girls and the guys. And I think I'm going to set Ava up with one of the guys. And then Ella will have the other one. And then they'll be, like, just the one we don't pick. I think Ava would actually really do well with... I don't know. Anderson? Or I feel like Charming is more for her. I don't know. Oh, I don't know. It doesn't matter. What we're going to do is have Ella come cook a cake if she could oh damn it edward is just gonna have like a ba okay you know what i'll have to go restart my game so we can have a cake because we can't do a birthday without a cake let, let me see quickly if selling the fridge does anything for us let's see cook cake nope Alrighty, so i'll be right back all right friends so the cake is in the to-do bar. We are going to do it right now. And Edward is actually going to plan his social event. And I think I want to set him up with... Did everyone else leave? Oh, no, they're all here. Oh. I think I want to set him up with um, Brandy. I feel like... I feel like they get along. I feel like they get along. So he's going to plan his birthday party. And it's not going to be a prestigious event. Just because I don't really care anymore. We've done so many of them. So they're all invited. And Nicole and Nicholas and Jason are invited. Ava has to go to work. So she'll just have to miss out. And it's going to be here. So she's making up the thing. So we're going to introduce ourselves to her and to her and to... Where'd she go? Brandy? Brandy? Okay, yeah. Yep, yep, she's the one. Screw these other girls. She's the one for us. Let's go right now. Oh, look at us in our party outfit. Oh, this is her party outfit. This... Uh, the skirt and the top are custom content, and I realize that all the tops have the bow glitter just on it. I guess it's because of the mold of it, the shape of the clothing. But anyways, this plaid skirt is to freaking die for. I just thought it was so 
fun. And because she's an insane sim, I don't know. I just feel that bright colored things are uh, what she does. She doesn't care. So anyways, Brandy's going to come down here. And we're going to say hi. Hey, how's it going? Oh, hi, Nicole. How are you? Oh, leg. We're going to ask her if she's single and ask her a risque question. Oh my god. That cake looks nasty. Add birthday candles. Good. So now you, sweetheart, I want you to uh, talk to Anderson and talk to... What are these two doing in here? Oh my god. The toilet's overflowing? Oh my god. No, okay. Oh, just replace it. And you gotta chat with this guy, too. And have a deep conversation, all that. But we're gonna get to know Brandy a lot more. Look at her. Look at that face. Yep, she's she's for our, she's ours. She's the one for us. So, yes. Let's chat, get to know her a smidgen more. Oh, she likes us, too. Look at that romance above the friendship. We're going to discuss interests and discuss fitness techniques. Oh, is he aging up? Blow out the candles. Oh, and Ava's home from work, so this is good. I need Ava to introduce herself to all these guys. And I don't know, I kind of feel like her and Anderson would be good. Or charming. I think maybe Ella would be best with uh, Lucas. I think Lucas is our man. But uh, Ander Dylan Anderson. I keep calling him Anderson. I don't know why. But they're all just like really. Okay, are we gonna come blow out the candles? Look at uh, what's her face, Janet. What is her name? There he goes. There's Edward. Yes. Sir Edward has aged into a young adult. And of course, his last trait is that he's actually evil. Boom. Done. Just like that. What we're going to do is we're going to quickly add candles. And we're going to age up Brandy. And Brandy is going to uh, get married to us. We're going to eat these chips. Is she going to... Yeah, okay, she's aging up, I think. Can she age up? Okay. Well, while we're waiting for that, Ella is apparently doing her child homework and getting to know the boys. Uh, we're going to brighten his day and get to know him and discuss interests and have a deep conversation. And ta -la -la -la. gossip with him, I guess. Good. And Ava, look at Dylan, oh yes. Ava, yeah, I feel, Ava. I feel Ava and Charming. I feel Ava and Charming. I think I do. Oh god, I don't know. I had a better idea when I was just looking at these sims in a creative sim. And now that they're here, I'm just like, I don't know. Look, like, Lucas, see, Lucas, what are you doing? I look at Nicole, just like smiling awkwardly. Is she gonna age up? Please age up. Oh my god. Okay, maybe... Okay, maybe let's remove candles and try it again. Okay, and then add birthday candles one more time. Oh, is she going to age up? Like, oh my god, look, here's uh, Evil Queen. Uh, and I want her to talk to him more, but at the same time, the party's almost over and we're like really, really hungry. Yeah, Jasmine's leaving. I think I should keep going, by. Okay, why don't you go talk to Lucas? Actually, no, we need you to cook. Make some garden salad for everyone. Just do it. Just do it. 
And is she gonna age up? Like, what is going on? Okay, let's get to know and let's fire her up. And let's. Deep conversation. Uh, maybe we should do something to get her to stand up. Let's hug her. Oh, there she goes. There she goes. Oh, yes. So now we can use a pickup line on her and flirt with her and all of that. Oh, I should really get going. No, come back. Just stay a little longer. She really likes Edward. We'll confess our attraction. Oh my god, yeah, just stand behind her and do it. <laughs> and we will... Ooh, sexy pose her. And offer her a rose, because that's romantic. <gasps> I knew it. I knew it. I gosh darn it knew it. Oh my god. No! Oh, poor Snow. No, Barrett. Oh, look, hi, Grim. How are you? Poor Snow White. Oh, Nicole's crying too. Oh. Oh, man, this hurts my heart. His money. We no longer get his money. My heart. Man, um, everyone else is just over here like, yeah, this is lovely. Oh, also, I redid uh, in here. Did I show this? I just wanted to lighten the thing in this rug is custom content. And uh, I took out the wall. Yeah. While Barrett's dying, I'm going over the renovations. Man, this is so violent. Like, oh, oh Barrett. He'll stay in here for a little bit for us. We're gonna say, oh, can't wait to see you. I think we should cheerful introduce ourselves to Grim Reaper. Just get to know him. Actually, what I want is I want Ella to know him. Come talk to him. Come talk to Grim Reaper. I want you to ask him about his day and get to know him. <laughs> Discuss interests, get to know. Complain about problems and tell a dramatic story. Also, show him your outfit. Because your outfit is bomb, girl. Your outfit's so bomb. Grim is like not even caring. We'll do an impression too and tell a joke about vampires because that'd make him laugh. Because get it? Vampires don't die unless you stake them or burn them. But you know. And Edward is just like, I'm going to sleep right here. <laughs> what I need him to do is join uh, the mixologist career. So yeah, culinary, and he's going to be going into mixology. Oh, okay, bye-bye, Grim. Okay, bye-bye. <laughs> so yeah, what an exciting day. So I'm really, really glad. Uh, we met all the guys and everything. I think these people are still here, but Snow is gonna come sleep, and Ava... <clears throat> I don't know if Ava and... I don't know. Maybe Ava will go with Dylan? Let's see. Come, uh... Oh, should... Okay, bye-bye, both of you. I just totally ignored the twins, too. Okay, Evil Queen, okay. Uh, but I'm going to skip until morning, so I'll see you guys then. Oh my god, it is morning. Never mind. Wow. It is four in the morning. Go to sleep, everybody. Thank god it's Saturday. But everyone needs to frickin' sleep. And... Yeah. Oh my god. How are these Sims not tired? What are they doing? What are they doing with their lives? Yeah, everybody go to sleep if you need to sleep. And... 
You're so totally behind. Celebrate his birthday. Yeah. Oh, and Brandy's still here. Well, hello, Brandy. You can leave at any time. I don't know what's wrong with you. But we're having a fairly interesting... Oh, look! Someone made a clay bunny! That's really cute. It looks like he's eating that bowl of salad. Oh. <laughs> oh. So, anywho, we're... Just, uh... Sleep him in for a little bit. Luckily, it's Saturday, or else this would be a problem. Uh, but we need Cinderella to... Cinderella. We need Ella to listen to music for a little bit. Uh, and, yeah. Oh, who knocked over our... Man. And Snow's gonna be really, really sad for a while, but morning usually helps. So now she's really sad because she's a widow from losing a true love. From mourning, from witnessing death of a loved one, the death of a loved one affects those closest to them. Sims can mourn at a tombstone to feel more at peace. But then a friend has passed from mourning a friend. It is important to mourn and remember the good life moments had with a departed Sim. She's also really, really hungry. So she's going to eat this garden salad and uh, I think I should reset Brandy King. You can leave at any time. There we go. She's gone now. Cool. So Ella's actually awake and she's going to use and take a shower. Because she is nasty looking. Now she's Cinderella. Get it? Because Cin... Never mind. Anyways. So today is going to be a day about getting to know our... Um, our people. And Edward, I think he has work today he does at 3 p.m. he needs to up his cooking skill a bit but because he can't actually cook we're gonna have to purchase a cookbook for him to read yeah because only Ella can cook which she's going to do when she comes downstairs she's gonna make scrambled eggs for everybody and okay yeah 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 yeah, I can see. Okay, cool. <laughs> Freaked me out. So, yes, we're going to uh, get Ava to chat with these guys some more. I also kind of thought of Courtney, but I think he's too much older. Then again, I don't think so. Let's invite him to hang out. We can actually wake up now. You don't need to celebrate Edward's birthday. Uh, Just so you know. And so I'd like her to shower quickly before he arrives, but I don't think he's going to be here quite soon. Oh, he's, yeah, he's right there. Right there. Never mind. Let's invite him inside. And ask him about his day and brighten his day and complain about parents, even though one of them died. Complain about our problems. Compliment his outfit. No. Nicole, you cannot come over. And, yeah, I don't know. Maybe we'll get to know him a bit. Oh, he is hot-headed and art lover and a snob. She's a loner, mentally gifted, business savvy, and gloomy. I mean, they don't really get along, but, I mean, he's cute. So, we'll just befriend him a bit while Ella cooks. Good girl, Ella. Snow, I do want her to also uh, write her book. I want her to... Oh, you can write a sad book. A sad book? All the sickly horses. Oh, my God. A sad book I read uh, was My Sister's Keeper. That book... Oh, my God. The movie was... I, I, I don't know. The movie was a little too different from the book. But anyways, the book... You yeah, should read the book. It is... Oh my god, it's so sad. So I think we're just gonna call it... We'll call it... My... Husband... Or my... Lovers... No, my loves... Finder. Or something. Or my sister's keeper. And this is the sad book. Write it. We need some publishing money. I know, darling. I know. 
I know, just put it into the book. Put all your feelings into the book. And maybe donate to a charity. That'll make you feel good. For Speak for Trees. That'll make you feel really good on the inside. And so Ella is very uncomfortably making scrambled eggs. <laughs> And then she's gonna eat, and although her fun is really, really low, we need her to actually listen to music. So she's gonna listen to alternative music. I also, actually, no, I want her to listen to electronica. I feel like she's one of those, like, I only listen to, like, underground electronic music, like, not like the ns, ns, ns house music, but yeah. We're gonna call everyone to the meal. So that everyone comes to eat, because everyone's pretty hungry. You should pee first, buddy, and then grab a serving. Same with you. Okay, you know the new Rihanna Paul McCartney song? I'm sorry for singing, I did not mean to, but that song is stuck in my head. And Ella, yeah, sit at the table, darling. Sit at the table. Look, I'll clear space for you. And Ava, why don't you invite him to talk, too? Any hoot. So, yes. Ella ate, and now she's going to go on a cleaning frenzy and clean the poop out of this house, because it is disgusting. There is... It is nasty. And the twins, you can sit here while you eat. You know that, right? You know you can do that? So Snow, work on your book. She's reached a level three, so she can also read non-fiction books for reference and discuss a favorite book and author with other sims. And she can write short stories. So if we read something... <coughs> I thought we had a book in our inventory, but anyways, if we take this, we can... Oh, is this an... Oh, wait, hang on. We need a non-fiction book. Here we go. Oh, we can study it! Oh, that's cool. Alright, so Ella is in the process of cleaning everything up. This is gonna take a while. There's so much... Uh, so many plates to clean up, and uh, Sir Edward needs to read his cooking book. <clears throat> Ava is swimming and getting uh, the fitness skills, so that's pretty cool. I want her to call, uh, actually invite Courtney. I wish I could invite them into the pool with you. I'll discuss logic puzzles with him. <laughs> And she wants to be alone for a little bit, because she is a loner. Oh, is she not talking to him? Why don't you compliment his outfit? I know, you're you're wanting to leave, but what I don't want you to do is not do that. And how's Ella doing? This is not a cleaning frenzy. You're frozen, but okay. So the twins need more fun, and then we can... I need to just make sure that they get A's. I'm not too concerned with getting their lifetime aspirations because we've done that with the uh, older kids. So yeah. No worries there. So Edward actually has to head over to work and <clears throat> get that culinary on. But yes. Okay, you can stop now. And how about you just clean up the plates? I'll help you. I will help you. And Snow finished her book. So that's nice. But, uh, we're gonna just have to come clean everything, I guess, on our own. And get it all cleaned up. Hello, can you go to work? What is with my sims not going to work or whatever? It's for Donkalis. We have to clean the showers and everything, and that's pretty much it. So that's cool. So he's off to work. And he's going to work hard. 
And Ava, darling, I want you... Yeah, continue to be friendly with him. Deep conversation him, brighten his day. And what I'd like to do is get Edward or Ava married. I think... Uh, I think Ava will get married. Edward will... Him and Brandy will just move out, get their own place, and yeah, and that'll be cool. But I think I'm going to end this part here. If you guys are enjoying the series, please do give it a fat thumb up and subscribe for more videos as I put them out fairly regularly. And so I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.